she actually asked me to <laughs> don't do it so in today's video i didn't mention a lot of things which i wanted to but i forgot so first things first um i know i look sick in that video because okay let's be real i look sick all the time because i don't get enough sleep and i just came from college and i decided to film that video so my eyes look very tired my face looks very tired so yeah that's one thing and the second thing is that if i arrange my top a lot and it bothers you i'm really sorry but i don't know how that top works i don't know if it's an off shoulder i don't know if it's a boat neck i fucking don't know excuse that and the third thing is that if i laugh at your confession or your secret please please excuse me because i could not believe if that was true enjoy the video <laughs> Welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to be reacting to your secret. To put it in better words, I'm going to be explaining how this works. Okay, so I put it up on my Insta story that hey guys, I made a Google form and I want you to send in your secret so I can reveal them and expose you. I made it clear that your name won't be visible to me as well as my audience. So basically, when I was nine, my neighbor, a girl, she's four to five years older to me, and I used to play and hang out together. So basically, I used to go at her place and we used to kiss each other, sleep with each other, and I was a damn kid. I had no idea about and stuff, but she definitely had an idea about what and all. I even remember there was this time where she actually asked me to, her. but like I said. I was a kid. I was like, she, she, ew. Ew. <laughs> and then my mom got to know about that because she caught us doing that. She looked outside of the window and she saw us doing this random shit. And then she called me home. I was really fucking scared, but yeah, she asked me to stay away from her. And my mom said all of this to her mom and yeah we still see each other and it's almost been 10 years now lamao and i even remember we used to call our other friend and basically we used to perform threesome are you making this up of course no penetration but kissing and cuddling and omg this is so fucked up yeah it is fucked up and i'm so glad that it stopped because This is so wrong. Okay, moving on. I have had those dreams about my teachers. Did you actually had those dreams or did you imagine and they automatically formed into dreams? If you know what I mean. I put a pencil in a guy's eye in first standard. I don't know. You tell me. I am gay. That should not be a secret, you know, because it should not be. It is 2019, and you should come out. And I do. I know this is a joke by a friend. I'm pretty sure this is joke. But if it is not, I respect you. I can be your friend. I will support you. Watching a guy having an ice cream turns me on most of the times, especially in the morning. If watching a video or something. Okay, wait. What? During school times I wouldn't take a shower for at least 4 5 days continuously and I also wouldn't poop for 3 4 days in a row and kill others with my bomb blasts. Ew. Oh, I you know what I had um in my school there was this guy who used to stink so much. What if he's the one? Ew. I stole red wine from my father's drawer in 7th grade and I took it to school in cylindrical shaped paper soap bottle which looked like test tube having a cap. Okay. We drank it on our back stairs and at that point we felt we are coolest kids on the earth. PS we were in court. Hashtag first my first time. Hashtag alcohol story and hashtag I am proud of you. That's cool but don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. This one is deep. I was suicidal deep inside. The only reason I can't open up because I have an image to maintain. Dude, don't think that you are suicidal. There are people who can help you out. Just don't keep it inside, okay? Just because you have to maintain an image, don't do that. Not at all good. I have people who clean wash my 
But this is made up. Do people actually have servants to wash their ass? I don't know. Summoned Satan and felt his presence. What? Everyone thinks I am this super confident person who can do everything and I am not faced by anything. When in fact I am really scared of failing and I am a very emotional person and things affect me. I am just good at hiding stuff and I don't like that and that's my secret. P.S. Sorry for a long reply and thanks for doing this. Felt good at 2 a.m. Well, I'm glad that you felt good. It's okay to fail sometimes. But no, it's okay. You can't be the perfect version of yourself 24-7. It's okay if you are not the best at everything. It's okay. It's okay. I sound like a therapist, but I'm not. I made out with a guy on the first date. When I was in third grade, there was this guy who was made to sit next to me. He used to put his noses on the desk and force me to touch it. He used to do that every day and I used to find reasons to change my place but my teacher never listened. So I told my teacher the actual reason but she thought I was making it all up. Dude, the child is in third grade and why would she or he make up the situation like why why would a three year a three year old no sorry eight year old do that like i agree there are people who are very mischievous like the guy who is putting his nosies but i don't think anyone would do that just for fun sake one day when he was doing it i yelled to seek my teacher's attention and she finally saw it wait wait what i hooked up with a friend's girlfriend so I guess this is it. I hope you enjoyed and let me know if I should turn this into a series or whatever. So make sure you follow all of my social media. At least Instagram guys, please follow me there. If you do, uh, you can be a part of this uh, series which I am planning on to continue. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.